What up, world? Welcome back to another episode of An Entrepreneur's Journey. I just remember this. I want to get this out. You know, I had a tax professor, a tax law professor in law school. And on the first day of class, he tells of the whole class, he says, on the last day of class, I'm going to teach you guys how to get rich. Right? So, of course, you know, throughout the semester, you have to show up to a certain amount of classes. So people were showing up. People miss classes here and there. But on that last class, everybody was there, right? Everybody was there. And he said, as promised, I'm going to tell you guys all how to get rich. And he said, there's three easy steps. Um, this guy's pretty well off, right? He's not Warren Buffett or, or Bill Gates, but he's got a law degree and a, and a CPA. So he's doing well for himself. And I'm sure he's seen a lot in his consulting practices, you know? So we're all paying attention, real, real alert. And he says, number one, buy insurance. You got to make sure you cover yourself. Number two, buy insurance. And number three, buy insurance. And he puts his chalk down. And I'm thinking to myself, this mother, this freaking guy, this guy, right? But, you know, it's funny. After, after I got over the fact that, you know, he's a practical joker, he, he was being, you know, serious to a certain degree. He took the time out to say that for a reason. And I started counting some of the things that hit me. Uh, medical bills or even car accidents that didn't have insurance, you know, when I was younger and a knucklehead. And the cost of it would have saved me a ton of money. When you just put up a video on opportunity cost, right? The opportunity cost of not having that, the, the amount of money I lost from not having that was huge. I would have been way richer. And, um, you know, I, I've, I've uh, thought of this a lot, you know, this insurance, buy insurance, buy insurance, buy insurance if you want to get rich. And for me, it really translates to cover your ass, cover your ass, cover your ass. If you know the bet you're taking, you know, and you're confident in that bet, and there's a good, there's low risk, right? That's because that's really what insurance does. It, it minimizes risk or eliminates the risk. So the more you know or understand something, and you can minimize that risk, um, the more you cover your ass. And that's really, I think, what he was trying to say is, you know, make sure you're covered, make sure you're covered, make sure you're covered. So I know it wasn't the best advice when I got it, but the more I thought about it, and you know, tell me what you guys think. Swallow it for a second, and. and and really understand, buy insurance, buy insurance, what would, you do? what would happen if you, everything you did was covered, right? If there was no chance of failure, like there was no chance that you, were, you weren't going to get your money back. You'd always get your money back. Um, that's some powerful stuff. So anyway, I thought it was funny. I wanted to share that with you guys. Hope you guys are rocking out, staying motivated, kicking butt, and uh, following your dreams, guys. Talk again soon.